All right, pick your team. Optic. Hudson has the Cardinals, Falcons, Ravens. Rotor has the Bills. Strong goes Panthers, Bears, Bengals. Rotor, Browns, Shelly, Cowboys, as in Lauren Shelly. Luke Counts, Broncos, Strong, Lions, Lauren Shelly, Packers. Michael Canicry has the Texans. Hegan, Colts. Counts has the Jaguars. Strong has the Chiefs. Rotor has the Chargers. Herbst has the Rams. Canicry has the Dolphins. Strong has the Vikings. Hudson has the Patriots. Canicry Saints, Testa Giants, Hudson Jets, Canicry Raiders, Hegan goes Eagles, Steelers, Canicry has the Niners, Hegan has the Seahawks, Blodgett has the Bucks, Rotor has the Titans, and Herbst has the Skins. Sister, you believe is Orioles? I think you're right. I just need to uh, verify it. I was going to say Orioles, but I don't want to... There is your case of optic. So, guys, I have a serious question um, for those that are still on or whatever. I um, I am going to be out of town on Wednesday. Rockhold can cover for me again on a Wednesday. Absolutely no problem. Or I can break Tuesday. Um, your call. I actually made the statement. Honestly, you know what I might do, dude? You know, now that I'm thinking about it even more again. I might just, if Rockhold wants to go Wednesday, fine. But I may just take the week, the day off anyway. Give you guys time to... Be ready for contenders. Because we got, like I said, I think about 30 cases of contenders coming. And um, I'm planning on, yeah, tomorrow. Right. Uh, I'm plan. you know what? I'll plan to break tomorrow, and I would love it if we could just fill that Bowman Super Jumbo 2015. I think we're down to 15 left. Uh, the Bowman's best. Or, uh, I'll, I'm going to post another picture team of optic. I got one optic case left. Contenders is coming, guys. I'm um, I'm probably going to start listing randoms for contenders and divisionals for contenders tomorrow. They will be posted under Friday. Um, if people want PYT, which seems to be doing pretty well, you know, we've been filling picture team stuff. There is no checklist out yet. So anyone that's pricing and posting pick your team up right now is going off of complete speculation. I will tell you their pricing is fucking bogus. Just my opinion, which I'm never really too short of. I'm sharing. <laughs> you guys know that by now. Uh, also, do you notice I, fit, I swapped the camera angle? So you got me on the left and you got my overhead on the right. Um, the overhead, I believe, is much more clear. You see a better depiction, whatever. So, I want to point that out. Hopefully, it's better. So, guys, uh, Friday night, I'm hoping that we can fill at least several cases with little to no minis. I am planning to go live, hopefully, around 7 7 30. And just rip contenders after contenders after contenders after contenders after contenders until we're out. So hopefully you guys are on board for that because that's my plan. Um, I don't really like pick your team for contenders. I'm just going to be honest because I think everybody should have a shot. I feel this way about everybody, almost everything, uh, or basically everything. I think everybody should have a shot at the big teams. Um, I would do some team drafts if we could fill them early enough, and I would let them run on the Facebook page to where um, you guys could have a random but pick your own team. 
dude. I'll tell you what. Last year when we did contenders, I had Lewis. I think was there. Lewis Fogg. I don't know if he's still on, but we had 25 cases, I believe, sitting behind me, which my table was. I was facing that way, and behind me over here against this wall was just like three big like folding tables, and it was just end to end, three rows up of contenders, maybe four rows up. And um, do I think that night we did 12 or 13 cases. We started at 7.30 and we literally finished at 9 something in the morning. And we probably could have filled another one. Um, but I was exhausted, you know, obviously. And my fingers uh, didn't have blisters, but they hurt. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, they literally hurt. That was the first time I can say, like, I was sore from opening wax. My fingertips, my thumbs, they were, like, raw. It felt like, uh, oh, yeah, I don't know. Can't really come up with a example of what it felt like, but, man, it sucked. I can't wait. Uh, I'm honestly, I, I want to rip two cases myself. Uh, whether or not I do, or I, I'm going to do one. At least that's, I'm, I'm for sure going to do one. I'm too much of a contender's junkie to not do one. But I, I would like to rip two, maybe even three. Nice up, buddy. Oh, yeah. Curious, and uh, never really asked this question like this, but I'm, I'm curious. Contenders, base, it sucks. I don't think anybody rips contenders or buys contenders for the base. I don't think anybody tries to build that set. I could be wrong. Uh, if we were to not ship all cards, but only hits numbered. Um, and could do a little bit better of a price point on it because of that. Is that of more interest? I don't know what the price point would be, but it would obviously be less because I'm not accounting for shipping 24, you know, packs of 12, bo 12 boxes of 24 packs of base um, to everybody in the break. Uh, would that be of interest? Or are there people on here who are like, I want all cards, I don't care. And I get it if you are. That's why I do all cards. I wonder, you know what, maybe I'll post, I'll do an experiment, and I'll post them that way, and in the description, and in the price point, you'll see a difference of all card ship, um, or, yeah, like, well, I mean, there's, rookies would be the inserts, otherwise it'd be the autos, there's no, like, base rookies and contenders. So like all inserts, serial numbered, and autos ship, and you could choose. I mean making up a number, I don't know if it's accurate, say it was a savings of $7 per spot or $10 per spot or whatever, is that significant enough to where you're like, oh yeah, do that, or are you like, meh, chip everything, fucker, <laughs> don't matter to me, several people are commenting hits only.
there's only a few people on, so I, right now, I haven't seen anybody say ship base. Ooh, that's sick. Oh, that's sick. Nice. Also, how much interest would there be in in like dual cases? Triple three cases, whatever. I mean, just curious. You know, would you want to just say, hey, dude, line three cases of contenders, fill that fucker, let's go. Or do you just want to go case by case? Uh, I'll probably post a divisional. I like Optic, too. I really like Optic, to be honest with you. Yeah, oh yeah, I, I would like to do that again. Um, here's my issue. 2016 contenders right now, for the price, in my opinion, isn't worth it. And I'm just being real. Like, it, the price on 2016 contenders is, is high. And, um, but yeah, I like it too. <laughs> I'm a contenders junkie, so I... You say the word contenders to me, and multi, or single, or anything, I, I'm listening. We could do that. Ooh, that's sick, too. But then, you know, someone did make the, make the statement, like, why not just get in two different cases that way? Um, it's up to you, you know. I, dude, like, I agree. A lot of people are, you know, even when we talk about 17 football, they're like, oh, 16 was so much better. I'm like, I totally disagree. Like, I totally disagree. There was two teams in 16. And that's it. With three guys that you're chasing, two of them being on the same team, and, and if you did a divisional, it was even worse. Because if you didn't land on the NFC East, it was like, okay, hopefully I get a vet auto. You know, any contenders... They're there, but they're harder. So, this year, I think there's a, a lot of good rookies. Yeah, now in Rams, but, I mean, Goff doesn't have anywhere near the same effect as Prescott, Wentz, and Zeke. At least I don't think so. Not yet. you got a ways to go, in my opinion. You know, one guy's selling for two, three hundred. The other one's selling for thousand plus. It's, it's different.
first six are open. That's what we're going to do. There you go, see him. Good luck. Ryan Switzer. Davies White Blue to two ninety nine. Carlos Henderson. John Ross for the Bengals, thirty four of fifty on card auto. Blue and red. Nice. Gary. Hey man, Merry Christmas to you, Joe. Wentz red to 99. Gary Stewart. Switzer again, OJ Howard. Tajay Sharp to 199. Watson base. Goff to two ninety nine. Guys, I'm just gonna say the color. Kaya. Save us some time on the all the two ninety nine, one ninety nine that I don't have them memorized. McCaffrey base. AP insert. Derek Barnett blue. Chad Hansen. Deck blue to 149. Joe Williams. Dez. Trubisky. I think he can do whatever he wants. I think he's going to leave there regardless. Juju. Josh Reynolds. 400 points. Ran that up at the end. Darius Stewart, Chris Wormley, Baltimore. I mean, if that's what he wants to do, he needs to go talk to Jerry, though. Jordan Willis Green, Corey Davis, awesome, Jake Terrell Davis, Blue, Mac Hollins, he would be, he'd be a solid pick for anybody, McCaffrey Red, I think it's the 99, yep, nice. P. Ryan, Dobbs, Stafford Red to 99, Hooker to 99, Foreman Base Rookie, Henry Hopkins Blue, Dobbs. I don't know why I'm pulling the Base Rookies Juju, I never do, so I'm not going to do that. Evan Ingram, 32 of 35. Giants on the auto. Optic Suite. Merry Christmas, Jake. Mike Williams. Hunt. 
Josh Reynolds, the Holmes base. Deshaun Watson. Tariq Cohen, 22 of 75. Nice. Bears. Blue. Gary. Anyone else? Uh, everyone, I said it when I first came on to you. Merry Christmas to all you guys. Hope Santa was good for you. Hope your family was well. Hope it finds you in good health and all that stuff. Brad Kaya. Nice. Jake Butt Orange. Mike Wallace to two ninety nine. Tom Terrific, Tommy Brady, forty six of ninety nine. Evan Ingram. Tate Purple, 21 of 50. Dalton. Jamie Collins to 149. Trubisky. Bears. Yuck. 24 of 150. Gary Strong. Michael Thomas, ninety four ninety nine. Davis Webb. I did not know that, Jason. Kevin King red to ninety nine. Joe Mixon. Gallman Blue. To 149, I think. On my home base. Trubisky, nice. Trubisky and Cohen so far. J Blue to 149. Kaya Refractor. 250 more points. Dobbs. 22 of 25 on the black and blue. Marlon Humphrey. 2 of 10 on the gold auto for the Ravens.
Kevin King Red. Yep. Ravens were what? Eight bucks? McCaffrey Refractor. David Johnson Blue. Jeremy Sprinkle Blue. Alex Smith Light Blue. Corey Davis Blue. Obi Melifonwu, $27.99 for Oakland. Another auto that's not on the checklist or wasn't when this was made because all they had for Oakland was Derek Carr. They were. They expired. Jake. Gerard Davis, Lions. Will oh, you expire? Yeah, the good one. Julio Red, John Ross Blue to one forty nine, Mahomes to two ninety nine, Marlon Humphrey again, Baltimore. What'd you guys think of the flawless full case as random teams? Did you think did you like it? Did you think it sucked? I mean obviously some people didn't hit and they're like, it sucked, but they'd say that no matter what. But just, do you like it? You want to see more flawless that way or no? Say Watkins light blue, or you just want to hit your ass? Chad Hansen, 15 of 50. Jets. Dude, why does it feel like it's like all up in my shit? Well, there are. But I mean, that's why I kind of like the random because everybody has a chance to get them. Jordan Matthews, blue. It was 95 bucks a spot. Genevieve Morton goes to the Rams. Chidobi Awuzi, Cowboys. Nah, I don't think Flawless is really Yankee hit. There's a lot of Yankees. I mean, there's there's several teams with a bunch of hits. That case was a, was a Yankee-heavy case, there's no doubt. But, but, I mean, it's Davis Webb. Everyone has a shot at the Yankees instead of if you're doing pick your team and then got the fat pockets coming to buy them. 16-35, Jordan Willis, Bengals. Joe Williams. Beat hard to 149. 
How many more flawless do I have, or does Top Cut have total? Total, we've got four more cases. No, full cases, so eight total briefcases. The big shit, man. Oh yeah, I haven't been at work, well, today. Or yeah, I went to work yesterday. I went and opened the shop down on New Year's Eve. But, uh, sitting there, I'm like, oh shit. Or at dinner, I'm like, I'm opening the shop tomorrow, huh? And my wife looks at me, she's like, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, what do you think about it? Nice, there you go. You know, this, that's all rock, dude. I don't do consignment right now. Uh, simply just had way too much going on. My wife, honestly, had way too much going on with school, books, breaks, shipping, three kids. You know, uh, yada, yada, yada. Like, just, just a lot. It's rock, that's all rock. All we do is send the money out. Wow. Don't all these packs be like that. That's a... It's funny, man. When I started doing a... Uh, what up, Kweeka? Hey, Kalika, what do I owe you? Like 150? Is that right? On that bullshit no call? 
I got hose on that game. I got hose on that game. I got hose at the end of the Eagles game. Do not kick, they don't kick the extra point. Like it shouldn't even have been that anyway, but hundred bucks. Alright. Figure it out. Wanna do uh huh. wanna do uh I can do a box of young guns tomorrow from the shop and then say I owe you twelve bucks or something like that, whatever the hell I sell them for, I remember. Or no. We can figure it out, it don't matter to me. Tell you what, man, if they can't beat them without staff, they have no shot. Like, that had to be, that has to be their thought process. Like, Kirster, you think you got a big enough lead? But you have 30 points? Your boys are all going to ride the bench next week. Most of mine are all going to play. And try to play their butts off. So hit that waiver wire, son. Falcons just gotta win one, man. Just gotta win one. Next game's at home. It's Carolina. Again, it's tough. We usually split with them. We usually split with the Saints. The Saints officiating game was awful. That Saints officiating game was awful. Why would Thomas play? Oh yeah, that's right. He didn't win the division. Carolina won that year. What if they both lose and Atlanta wins? Can Atlanta win the division that way, or are they completely out? I don't know. I don't even care. I just want to make the damn playoffs.
Who does Seattle play? Dude, it wasn't it wasn't as bad as that game, dude. In my opinion, I I agree, it was bad, but it wasn't that bad, dude. That play, that officiating in that game was awful. Yeah, no ball in Ingram tonight. Seattle plays Arizona, so they're going to win that game. Oh, Camaro's legit. There's no doubt. Dude, I mean, not really, though. You think about it. We we got stopped or fumbled twice inside of the five-yard line in the red zone. Um, the Julio catch, to me, was a touchdown that they reviewed and said it wasn't a touchdown. I, I thought it was a touchdown. I don't know how it wasn't a touchdown. Um... The interception they got were on the dudes. I don't know. I mean, no, I'll take I'll take Ingram over Kuzma. Uh, I'll take Ingram over Kuzma by a lot. The interception on the dude's back of his leg or whatever, like that's freakish. Uh, you know, I mean. There was, there was a lot of weird shit that happened in that game. The non-fucking pass interference call for Julio. Like, uh, they threw the flag and picked it up so the pass was uncatchable. It's like, how do you know it? Dude, it landed seven yards ahead of him, and he got tackled ten yards back. Like, how does that, how does that not happen? How was that not PI? There was just so much shit in that. So we had a first. We had a we had a big first down. They called back because the the fullback fucking like. Oh. There was definitely some home cooking. I, I would love a game three. Uh, no bucks autos to, that I, I don't believe. Oh, that was an awful call, Lane. Lane, that call was awful. But any of those, I mean, we were driving on that. Dude, that was a big, deep pass. All of a sudden, that puts us inside the 20. Even look at that. Like, let's say we, 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 we kick that field goal. Matt Bryant makes it. Say we don't score a touchdown. That's 9. Eliminate the fumble inside. That's 16. It's a different ballgame. So, but I mean, I know obviously you can't do that, but I'm just saying that the things were there. That wasn't the only blatant bad call. That fucking false start on Derek Coleman was an awful call. All the non calls on New Orleans, there were some, there were some bad calls, man, or non calls. We got hit with. Uh, we, we were the second least penalized team in the NFL. You know, we got hit with uh, two or three unsportsmanlike conduct penalties. There was a there was a no call on Matt Ryan getting hit helmet to helmet when the dude straight up got blasted helmet to helmet. Ryan Ryan never begs for call. Uh, begs for calls, dude. He's on the ground, literally like freaking out. Um, I don't know, man. Again, there was bad officiating in a. In the game in Atlanta too, so I won't be again. All I want to do is I just want to get in the playoffs, man. <laughs> so if we can get in the playoffs, all of it's for naught. I would think it'd be pretty damn sweet if we had our third game between the big, you know, the big rivals of Atlanta and New Orleans. Those games are always crazy.
Yeah, yeah, that was. It was a shit call, Lane. It was an awful call. Dude, there were some there was some there was some awful calls. And it gave up a it, it made differences. I mean, do we had stops on third and third and five, third and seven, I think, that all you know both got negated due to some weak ass penalty call and I get it, weak penalties are penalties, but like there was some stuff in there that was called just like come on dude. But whatever. Let's go. Josh Reynolds. Curtis Samuel, 125 of 150, Carolina. Yeah, I think we're going to beat Carolina. It's in Atlanta. I mean, we can't ask for a better setting. Win and you're in versus Carolina. I mean, yeah, they're good and all, but I think we get in. Glenn and Red. Unless they're just out, oh, man. <laughs> Derek Barnett, blue. Dante Freeman, blue. Uh, Gail Sayers, blue. Carlos Hyde, light blue. Obi Melifonwu Orange. Yeah, can't no. I I don't. I disagree. I, I we already know what Cam's going to show up. It's going to be the Cam that's going to run. It's going to hurt you. And it's going to do those things. Why wouldn't Cam play? Are they in no matter what? No, they're trying to win the division. Why the hell wouldn't Cam play? Kenny Galladay, 63 of 99, Detroit. Randall Cobb, gold. 4 of 10. Carlos Henderson. Yeah, but we all play at the same time, don't we? Didn't they change the schedule? Our Darius Stewart. Blue and orange. I think they changed the schedule to where all teams in Hunt are at the same time. James Conner, red. Marshawn Lattimore, red. Kids are good. Luck Blue. Curtis Samuel. Oh, I don't know. I, I have I have no idea. And Panthers at four twenty five, that's weird. That'd be a weird time for a that game. Michael Thomas Blue. I'm gonna look though when this gets, when this is done. Hassan Reddick, red, ninety nine of ninety nine. OJ Howard, base. Michael Thomas, blue. Brandon Marshall, blue. Tyron Matthew, the Honey Badger, blue. Another gold. Jamal Adams gold to 10. 6 of 10.
Joe Mixon, 54 of 79. Auto. Bengals. Davis Webb, blue and orange. Davis Webb, refractor. Darbo, hunt base. Russell Wilson, light blue. Samaje Pirine, two of 25, black and blue. Skins. All the games. Yeah, I thought so. All games are played. They're being played at the same time. Joe Mixon. So they can't decide to tank or not. So let's say this. Let's say Atlanta gets in. We go in as, I'm assuming, the sixth seed. Carolina would be the fifth seed. Who would we play? Sidney Jones, Orange, 130 of 139. Let's say New Orleans wins the division. They probably go in as the, the four seed, Darbo, Red. Or are they the three? Where do the Rams fall? Wentz purple. Home base. They should have signed his ass a while ago. That's stupid for them. Dalvin Cook to ninety nine. Rams three, Saints four. Dalvin Cook to ninety nine again. So we would get the Rams. Deshaun Watson on the refractor. Nah, I'd rather play New Orleans in fucking a dome. Juju base. Jimmy G stays in San Fran, don't he? James Conner, 17 of 75. Pittsburgh. Isn't he there under contract? Crowell Orange. Yeah, they're tough. David Johnson, red to 99. That's what I'm saying. I'd rather play New Orleans in a dome. Brandon Marshall, blue to 149. Then outside versus the Rams. Randy White, red to 99. Jimmy's going to get paid. Lattimore, Marshawn Lattimore, rookie green, one of five. That's nice. We got the Saints. Canacree. It's good. Uh, 
Nah, I don't think you are looking at Kirk. All shine, light blue. Hassan Reddick, red. Last box. I wouldn't be surprised if they just straight up signed him. Uh, is that going to be a one of one? Tredavious White? No, sorry. 10 of 25. Duh, they did the supers. I forgot. I'm thinking the black ways. Zay Jones, 9 of 25 for Buffalo. I mean, he didn't lose a game. Yeah, I pulled all those for him, dude. David Johnson, orange. Which a Howard refractor. Cup, Cooper, Cup, Blue. Yeah, I do the random on those points. So, Aaron Rodgers, Light Blue. Last stack. Derek Carr, Dark Blue. Mac Hollins, Vital Blue. Who's that go to? Tampa. Dick by tail. Those cards are dumb too. There's your case. We got uh, 640 points. Let's random those right now. Yeah. There's your list. Points. Dice are a ten. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. Scott Hegan. Rats, there's your code. <sighs> there it is. Do I believe in who? Yeah. 